Okay, sometimes when you're working in Google Classroom, you'll have a student uh, that tells you their assignments are missing or that you know Google ate their assignments or their assignments aren't showing up. And even you as a teacher, you might see some weird stuff that um, indicates that there's somehow uh, files missing. So first, uh, just kind of understand that Google Classroom is just a front storefront, if you will, for Google Drive. Every single thing you're sending, um, if it says make a copy, uh, if it says view only, um, view only looks, uh, it goes to the left side for the student. If it's a make a copy, it goes to the right, but all the file transfer is actually done in Drive. So almost always, 99.9% .9 of the time, it's a user error situation. So I've made this assignment. I called it the no attachments example. I sent it to my two students. The directions are, here's an assignment. Please open it. Don't hit the X. Now I sent four things. Um, and on the student work side, I see currently a picture of both students' names with icons for their work. So that's where we are right now. Now, we're going to open up and show you a student. So I'm going to go into the pre-K student. Uh, this student opens up their work, and on the left side, you see the things that are view only. Things that are view only always show up on the left, um, whether it's links, pictures, videos, um, even docs. Anything that's view only will come over here. On the right-hand side, uh, if the student hovers over the name of the, of the piece of uh, work here, and hovers just far enough to the right, they can activate this X. If they hit this X, basically it'll say a file Matthew Swarczyk copied for you was removed. And they'll have nothing there. What does that look like on the teacher side? On the teacher side, all of a sudden, you have this thing that says no attachments assigned or no attachments. Um, this makes it seem like Google might have done something wrong, but in all actuality, the thing that triggered this situation was the student deleting it in Google Classroom. So how do we fix it? The student can do one of two things. They could make a copy. If they've done no work, um, you could advise them to make a copy, and the, the it'll basically go back through and remake the copy they were given. But if they uh, would like to get used to doing this, uh, the, the right way. What should happen is if they click Google Drive, it should show up right there, which it does. But if they want to follow back, they would go to My Drive, Google Classroom, pick the class. So this is Test Classroom. And then they can find literally anything they've ever been assigned or touched before. So they go and they add it. Once they re-add it, it's the same assignment. Uh, they can jump back to the teacher here and we will see if we refresh we should have fixed our situation and now our files are back so if you see no attachments that is the fix and I want to say one other quick thing and that is that if a student goes in and does work on their copy so let's say just for the sake of argument, I'm going to put a big circle over this. If they do work on their assignment, delete that assignment, and then go back and add it again from the Google Drive, it doesn't delete the work they did. It just tucks it back in the drive. It takes it out of the storefront, puts it in the, so in the stock room.